New Year's Day here in Glasgow, the 2nd of January. Yeah, in Scotland, we have two New Year's Days, the 1st of January and the 2nd of January. So yeah, out to the Scots on your New Year's Day break. Yeah, we're back in the city here, out to the London Massive, all the England crew are at work. But yeah, you're watching this. Yeah, just letting you know, we're still on the go here. Got this for the cover coming out later this year. Dramatic in between the lines, 12 inch. And um, yeah, the progression has been over Christmas, we've been pretty hectic, but we have managed to get this um, in between the lines. The title for the A side by Dramatic, the drum and bass tune coming out. And um, yeah, yes, yeah, so I've been working on it. Out to Sam Douglas Jr. and Bakery yesterday. They like the they like the fluidity of the the paint there on the there's um yeah, so. Yeah, just getting this in, just say on there, so you can see I'm here, rough, rugged, and raw, getting busy for 2024. This painting will be going on shirt. My um, excuse the finger there. I'm having a big retrospective. Um, I'm, I'm 50 this year, and I'm born in 1974. Yeah, I'm having a huge retrospective at the Bomb Squad space in York, where I had the um the show last year, Educated Vandals, and I had the floor with Rowdy. I'm having a solo floor of that building this year. Um, James Jess at 50 paintings, my 50th anniversary. 1990 to 2024 a painting from each year it's going to be yeah it's going to be happening so yeah i'm just working on the 3d here in the studio and um yeah so yeah i just want to show you here getting busy i always like to get a video on the board the start of the new year i'm working in london teaching next week at city of london art school with the fine art degree students the ba year one where I've been teaching since October 1999. I've done the transcription every year since 99, and it sort of rolls on. Yeah, see, I've been there 25 years this year, 1999 to 2024. That'd be in October, so you've got a few months for that to go, yeah. But yeah, I'm just putting the 3D on here. Out today's watching this back in the future. Yeah, give us a follow on the channel. Hurts out. Yeah, we do. I'm right-handed, but I draw. I draw a bit of my left hand because it's easy to film. Oh, we've got a drip there. Oh, see what happens when you draw with the right hand. But yeah, we'll go. We'll go with the drip. We'll switch hands. Oh, we got a drip there. Drip. That'll be all right. It's nice and juicy. See, as I've said many times, I've been using these. Uni Poscas for my graffiti artworks since about April 1987. Mark Cheese and Rest in Peace introduced me to the pink pens. I saw some tags in Lake Mosley in the subway and then the pink and I was like, how do you get them? So we sneaked on the train 38 miles to London. We got them from Cowling and Wilcox, pink ones. And even originally I used them on paper for graffiti and for tagging on the streets. I've always used them for both. So yeah, this is lines. I did this on my um, Instagram live actually. The um, well, I did the in between bits. So there's enough read here. But yeah, I'm just I'm just trimming it up. But yeah, a vital, vital thing is as an artist as well as your cheap food. So yeah, I'm just having the first thing on my degree in fine art. Pete McCarvey said on his 18 in 1992 was yeah, have your lunch in front of your painting. See, so yeah, I'm just cooking up some lunch here on his hot plates. Keep the budget down a bit. Yeah, I find a cheap one. Just yeah, just some tuna and tomatoes. That's always been a budget lunch for me as an artist. Yeah, that's kept me going over the years. So yeah, that's a little tip for you. Get get some hot plates there and keep it nice and safe. So yeah, you need that in these expensive times, isn't it? So let's get some three D on there. Just get it popping a bit more. Every bit counts. See, I'll be working in London next week on the transcription at City Gives London Art School by Kennet and Tube Station. SC11 for DJ, that's the college, the address. If you want to get, have a visiting day. Going real good there. See, it's dramatic in between the lines. 
and yeah, I'm using the Titian for the composition this time, which you would have seen in the other videos. There's the Titian. I'm mixing it with the Martha Keeper photograph. I took it with Martha in the Bronx at Ray Street in 2010. It's a similar kind of palette to the Titian, I feel, with some greens in the lower areas and the blues at the top. So yeah, yeah, it's going real well on here. First live video 24, signing in. Once again, respect to everyone watching it back. Let's give this lines. So I did the letters in freestyle on my um, Instagram. Like I said. Let's get that popping. So yeah, leave it at that for today. That was just an intro. So you know I'm out and about, yeah. Here at Studio Jesse. It's absolutely massive in here, actually. Look, check it out. It's a full beast of a studio. Yeah. Been going for many a year, isn't it? So watch out for the retrospective this year. This one's in progress as well, this big subway one here. Part of the train there. And some of the other cameras that you just passed, they're all going to be going in my retrospective because I've got all the styles. Oh, I did 10 years, the whole decade of the 90s, the noughties, the 10s and the 20s. Like, um, yeah, it's very important to me, like, and I, you know, like Art Picasso would have a retrospective. You, you wouldn't just show like the blue period. I want to show all the periods and the strength and depth that I've got. Because I feel like some of the artists around 2003 that weren't even making works on canvas kind of like jumped on the bandwagon. And um, yeah, but I think I've got an extra like 10 years before that of strength and depth that I've built up. I think it will be interesting for people to see. So, yeah, there's all kinds of works over the studio here, transcriptions here. So, yeah, yeah, will leave you with that one, innit? Yeah, mix out the stars of the urban art. It's here, Studio Jessup. James Jessup, artist. Oh, could I put that on there? So, yeah, we'll see you all more soon, yeah? Subscribe to the channel, and then, yeah, have a great rest of your week. Um, January 24, we'll get raw. All right, more soon, yeah? See ya. See ya, see ya, goodbye, goodbye, thanks for checking it out. See ya in the next video.